Chrome OS 127 is here and brings many new features and enhancements for your Chromebook. Give this video a thumbs up now and subscribe to this channel for free if you want to support me in my work on how to Chromebook. Let's start right away with the first practical innovation for all Android smartphone users. Thanks to the new Quick Start function, you can now set up your Chromebook with your smartphone much faster by connecting them via QR code. Your Chromebook will then directly adopt the most important settings, access data, and saved Wi-Fi networks from your Android smartphone, making it even easier for Android users to get started with their Chromebook. The Chromebook camera also gets an AI update. Similar to current Android smartphones, you now have an improved digital zoom, which allows you to adjust the camera section much more flexibly and with better image quality thanks to the AI-based super resolution. If you use the magnifying glass as an operating aid for your Chromebook and have Chromevox read out texts from websites, the magnifying glass now also follows the spoken word, making it easier for you to follow the text being read out using the magnifying glass. You can now also adjust the blinking speed of your cursor in Chrome OS by going to the settings, clicking on accessibility, and increasing the blinking speed of the text cursor or turning it off completely in the keyboard and text input section. Swiping back and forth on websites in the browser is actually a very practical feature. However, as it can sometimes happen that you accidentally swipe forwards or backwards on the touchpad, you can now also deactivate the switch between pages with swipe gesture function in the accessibility features under cursor and touchpad. If you use Family Link, you can now also restrict or manage the use of browser extensions on your children's accounts. In my opinion, this is a long overdue feature that is now finally available. If you use multiple calendars in Chrome OS, you now also have the option to keep an eye on them in the quick calendar overview in Chrome OS. Activate the flag, hashtag multi-calendar in quick settings, flag, and then restart your Chromebook. The events from all your Google calendars will be displayed in your Chrome OS calendar. If you want to know how to play Fortnite on any Chromebook, click on the video on the left now. If you want to know five reasons why you should buy a Chromebook, click on the right video now. And I say thank you for watching and see you in the next video.